I'm Steve Spreester. These are your latest headlines. A Bear County jury has found Devonte Snowden, who was charged in connection with the fatal police shooting of 18 year old Charles Roundtree Jr. Not guilty of being a felon in possession of a firearm. Prosecutors accused Snowden of reaching for a gun last October when SAPD officer Steve Casanova entered a home on the northwest side while investigating an assault call. Upon seeing Snowden allegedly reach for a weapon, Casanova opened fire, killing Roundtree. A grand jury opted not to indict Casanova for the shooting last week. Snowden's attorneys argued that he never had a weapon. A handgun was found outside of a bedroom window of the home, while a ma matching magazine was found inside the bedroom. It's a little surreal. It's kind of mixed emotion. He never should have been here in the first place. He never should have been charged with anything like that. He didn't have a gun. And it, it's just a testament to the faith, and we have faith. And um, we, you know, we kind of we live by that faith. Body camera footage of the incident was played in the trial and likely played an important role in the jury's decision today. Investigators still trying to figure out how a fire was started at a home in Elmendorf early this morning. That fire broke out just before 3 a.m. Thursday morning at a home in the 17,000 block of South 2nd Avenue. Firefighters say it took about 30 to 40 minutes to knock down the flames, and once they got it out, they estimated damage to be about $50,000. No one home at the time. Firefighters say that family was out of town. Elmendorf police have called on investigators from the Bear County Fire Marshal's office to help them determine the cause. It's all of our time for now. You can find the latest headlines on our website, ksat.com. Be sure to follow us on Twitter and like us on Facebook.